here is a simple tips. Uh, let's say you are creating a reference frame. Did you ever notice that once you create a reference frame which is from left to right, the name clip to name will be at the bottom. So let's place the name for this. So, reference frame is reference left to right. That will be the name and let's have it placed there. So now you can see it's once we select it, it's at the bottom. Now once we set create another reference plane which is from right to left, you will see that the click to name or the label is on top. Let's create another is that is right to left so let's apply and you will see it's on the top side while this reference plane is below or at the bottom so what does it mean once we place some objects which is in reference to this plane some of it will be placed below following the left to right and those who are referring to this plane it will be placed above this which is following the right to left plane so let's create some object now that we have created the right to left and left to right working we are going to create a simple family let's create new and family Let's use this uh, metric and let's use a generic model so we can assign it as a work plane, work plane based family. Here we're going to do such a simple illustration with a circular thing. So let's say here, apply, and let's have it assign it a material. Let's set, set a color to blue so we can easily identify it. Apply, include it. Today we can see it's now it's this is the object. We can actually make it bigger so we can identify it easily. Now make sure you have selected the work plane base and uncheck the always set that. Set apply and then load this family into the project. Yes, we will save it as family two. Let's select it as one copy, save, and we load it into the project. Okay, we cannot load it, so let's save it as family, but with a different family, let's say uh, reference. Click the option and one, two, three. And now let's load it back to the project. We cannot load it earlier because uh, there was a name with the same name, family with the same name that has already been loaded in this project. Now we're going to reset our plane. And let's select reference from left to right. Click OK. And now let's once we have set that, let's place the component and here select place on work plane. So let's select it. Here you won't see it because it's above this floor level. Let's just exit this one and let's go back to back elevation. Now we can see here that. Once we use the left to right, it is placed on top of this reference plane. This is the object that we have created, which is the blue color. It should be blue. Consistent color. Let's edit the family again. And let's see why it's not.
Now let's change this material color. So let's select this and let's select another material. Let's use underground walls. Here, let's use this one. Okay. And let's have a look at it in shaded view and in realistic. So this is how it looks like in realistic. Let's load it into project and click OK. Yes, yes. Overwriting system parameters and value. So now it's shown as this color in shaded view. Or well, in realistic, it's going to be in a blue, in a gray color. Now let's select again. This one is the right to left. Let's use this as our work plane. Let's set it. Just right to left. Let's double check it. Right to left. Okay. Architect. Set. And let's use right to left. Click OK. Let's use floor plan level 1. Open view. And let's place in our component, which is this reference base. And let's place it. Select as place on work plane. Don't forget, otherwise, it will be placed within this uh, floor level 1. So let's select it. Now, let's have a look in 3D view. Here is the first object and this is the second object let's go to the block area as you can see once you have selected this work plane even though we created this model from top three, once you have created the reference plane from right to left the position of the object will be in reverse it will be placed at the bottom or below the reference plane so that is what the difference between using a left to right reference point and a right to left reference reference planes once you are inserting a reference plane or work plane based family in the 